Hey guys, so I am taking you out to the garden again because I've got another surprise. Now I did um, harvest another cucumber yesterday. I gotta water these because they're getting wilty. Um, but my husband came home and he was like, there's another surprise in your garden. So we are coming out here. Everything does its growing at night, it seems, because you come out the next morning and things have changed so much. There's my nice, a nice big pumpkin. Another nice big pumpkin. There's another one back there. Now I know that there was a little one starting back here. There's that. We're going to have one starting there. There's a nice big pumpkin right here. And I know that there's another one over here. But, you know, I told you I detasseled my corn, which was this one, my sweet corn, and this one. This one now has tassels that I'll have to detassel, but I don't want to do it right away. But look down here, guys. I've got my first ear of corn developing, which is very exciting. It's the only one. And they will form right by these leaves. Um, it doesn't look like I got any ears coming anywhere else. It looks like I might have one that'll come out here, um, but nobody else has any. But this has nice, the nice tufts that you would peel off the stringy stuff you would peel when you husk your corn. Um, so I've got that starting there. That's very exciting for me. There's bees coming to pollinate. Don't want to detassel them too early, what I've read. So those tassels have only been on there since right after I detasseled these. So I'll give it a, probably a little bit longer before I take the tassels off. Um, my peppers going down here. These are my tomatoes. Looks like I've got a bloom. I've got blooms on these. This tomato baby. Finally. And I am going to have... There's a female uh, flower. So that'll become a cucumber. Um, and it was right around here that I had harvested my last cucumber, and I know that there's another one that's going to be starting. I saw it. Um, right here. So that's going to be another cucumber coming in. Super, super fun. And I will tell you the truth, guys. I have never been a cucumber person. Isn't that a beautiful sight? I have never been a cucumber person. Never cared for it. But, um, I actually don't mind. I've tried my homegrown cucumbers and I actually like them. So that's exciting for me that, you know, I've never eaten cucumbers before because I didn't care for them. And uh, now I'm like, give me, give me some cucumber. <laughs> Beautiful. Look how big it is, guys. Looks like I got a worm here. Get off, dude. Little slug guy. I can't even focus on it, can I? 
little slug. So, put you there, little slug. But, yeah, very exciting stuff happening here in the garden. So, like I said, I do, I do need to come out here and weed. I have the tomorrow off, so maybe I'll do that. Come out and pull out those excessive weeds over there. Um, but this is all the bigger my guard, my yard is in width. And look how much room my pumpkins take up. Most of it. <laughs> Most of it. So, uh, yeah, besides the garden area now and the fire pit and the sidewalk is right here. So it's not a large yard. It may, I know that pictures and videos always make it seem like it's larger than it is, but yeah, it's all it is Then the driveway. And then we got the side yard there a little bit and we don't have much of a front either. Over here is where I've got some of my babies buried. This is Oreo. Oreo's buried here. Um, Sophie is buried here. No. Oreo. Milo. Sophie. And then there's another brick hidden under all of this. Um where Finney is buried. It's just this ground cover uh, is hiding, hiding it. But there is another one in there. I'm going to have to weed this. But this is where my babies are buried. Um, but yeah. So that's what's going on, guys. And over here is popcorn it does it's not doing as well as that popcorn but this was like volunteer popcorn guys this was popcorn that when i was growing um there's two two stalks um when i was uh growing my like sprouting germinating my pumpkins i had kernels in the bottom of the cup to to act as drainage um and the kernels germinated. So I just thought I'd just throw them there and see what they do. And I really have been neglecting these. These are what I want to really spend time with. But neglected these and they're still doing okay. They're just small. They are younger than, of course, these ones. Which if I uh, stand next to this one if I can without um, it's pretty much when I straighten out this leaf it's taller than I am and I am 5'6 um, and this is popcorn this one when I straighten it out comes up to my chin but this one is taller than me so yeah And it feels like there's some more. There's, they're starting to tassel inside this leaf. So they will tassel soon. Um, and then this is my sweet corn, which is catching up to my popcorn, but they are younger. And obviously they start to grow their ears um, sooner than popcorn. So this is super soft. But, yeah. So, anyway, that's what's going on in the garden. Hope you all have a wonderful day, guys. I have to work today. I have to be there at 1. It is, uh, what time is it right now? Not sure, currently. Uh, I'll have to double check. But, I have to leave in a couple of hours. And then I close. But I'm cashier today. I am not, uh, kennel. So... We'll see how it goes. <laughs> Everybody have a wonderful day and I will talk with you later.